So if I bag me. Hey y'all, it's your girl Kiari and welcome back to my channel. So as you see in the title, I have a review for y'all. Now I have not done a review on my channel in a very long time, but this video is definitely very special because I secured not one, but two Telfar bags. Okay, okay, okay. Like, you really can't tell me nothing. Now, before I jump into the review, I do want to give a little background about Telfar. So, I have my laptop here. Telfar um, is a unisex line established in 2005 in New York City by Telfar Clemens and sold internationally. Most importantly, it's not for you, it's for everyone. And that's also another key thing that made me purchase the bag and really get into the brand even more because I love the accessibility component of it. I love that it's affordable, yet it's still garnered as luxury. Like it's a black owned brand doing its thing and I wanna support. So nonetheless, I will leave their uh, website down below in the description box if you don't know and you wanna know more. And I'll also leave like a couple articles to kind of give you a little bit of background because this brand just did not come out of nowhere. It's been around for a while. And I believe the shopping bag in particular came out in 2015. So they've been around, they ain't new. Because the bag became so hype and so many like thirsty resellers kept trying to use bots to like buy up all the inventory every time Telfar did a restock, um, he would try, um, the company would try to send out emails if you signed up. They were being very active on their social media and really trying to reassure their supporters that you know they were getting things out as soon as possible they want to make items available as soon as possible but of course because of covid and they are still considered i believe a small business um there's just a lot of contingencies that come into play and then again you bring in the thirsty reseller bots which i don't rock with none of y'all because y'all are really trash your trifling ass is getting the coon tax it was just extremely hard to get a bag and so um, I just held it down and I was patient just because, like I said, I genuinely love the brand. So in total, I was able to get two bags. And so I am looking for like two more colors or three more bags. I'm looking for the medium black, the small black, and the small red. So those are the three more bags that I really need. So your bag will most likely come, especially if you're just ordering one at a time or whatnot, your bag will come in uh, a very structured box like this and you it will be shipped via UPS. You will have tracking um, included and you will also have to sign off for it. So I really did like that because shipping is really crazy as we know. So um, you obviously you break open the box. Let me make sure, okay, this is the first one. So your receipt is gonna be inside and then your bag is gonna be neatly input into like a Telfar branded poly bag here. And then you just unzip it there. And then um, it's also indicated on the bag too what color and size you purchase. And then there's a really nice, um, I would say quality enough dust bag. And so um, when I was watching reviews like way back, some bags weren't coming with, uh, well, coming, weren't coming with. And then I definitely missed something. Oh, my Fenty Beauty lip gloss. It must be in my bathroom. So again, I can still fit a nice amount and keep it closed. Or if I want to style it open, I can. Some bags were not coming with dust bags when I watched some videos way back. So I'm glad that the new bags are coming with them. And so, I couldn't help myself, y'all. I already wore the bag. I already kind of took it out um, and wore it already. But look at this beauty. Again, this is the orange small shopping bag. And I don't know if the camera is really giving it justice, but as you can see, you see the branding there. And then you have the two top handles 
and then the two body strap or excuse me the two like cross body strap uh, straps there now if I didn't mention already this is vegan leather so it's not genuine leather but the quality is not like cheap or cheesy at all um, and for me I'll definitely be keeping this bag in my dust bag just to you know uh, for its longevity and then has a little clamp right there on the inside with a magnetic clamp and then you have the Telfar emblem branding on the inside and then again it's a pretty nice size um or it's just pretty nice on the inside it's not as small as i thought some people i felt like were being were exaggerating on how small it was so i'll show you right now how what how much stuff i can fit so i'm putting my phone in in here right now my iphone in there so that's in there one second let me grab a couple things now if i needed to put my keys in there i got my keys bam still have a nice amount of room my little wallet holder in there my chapstick in there my hand sanitizer my little mirror and let's go from there so I am snapping it closed right now and there it is all those items I just highlighted are in here and I'm still able to close it so let me show y'all again I have my phone my wallet um, card holder my what's this stuff called hand sanitizer hand sanitizer my keys like i said i have my little vanity mirror in there also when i received the bag um the stitching was spectacular no stitching was coming out no cosmetic issues um again i just can't genuinely say anything negative or anything of a critique on this bag the shipping was great um i think i ordered on a wednesday restock and then i received my bag the following tuesday so they generally tell you five to seven business days so i definitely got my bag within that time ups shipment signed off for it and it came neatly packaged nothing sloppy and so y'all i mean I really have to give a thumbs up and I like I said I've worn it already so I can't wait to wear more but this color this color and melanin I mean sis now let's go to the next color so again the next bag when I received it it had my receipt and everything the poly bag unzip dust bag and then this is actually how it looks when it comes in look at this color like I was a little nervous initially when I when it came out because I was just like I hope it doesn't look like cheap but this color is almost like a champagne gold and it's just so pretty and so this bag i definitely plan to wear when like i'm really stepping out you know special occasion maybe um and then it has like the tag there and stuff and it's just so gorgeous i won't go into what i can stuff in there because like i said i believe i can stuff quite a bit of items into this bag now I don't plan to put the whole world in this bag you know I genuinely carry light um, so to carry the world is not really my thing but I do want the medium size you know to you know carry my laptop and things like that these small shopping bags are $150 the medium, I believe, is 207 Again, I'll put the link down below. And then the large, I believe, is like 257 So they are very affordable. They are very, very affordable. And because Telfar is always doing restocks, and he just recently did the bag security program, I mean, he 
and his team and just their brand is making so many efforts to meet the demand and so many efforts to, again, make this bag not just for you, but for everyone. So please do not support no resellers. If you're supporting a reseller, it just sounds to me like you're just being thirsty and you're just trying to be hype and, you know, just to say you have a tail far bag. I mean, just to be honest. I've seen this bag upwards to like $600 plus dollars like on eBay and offer up and I'd be damned. So, oh, they honking because they know, uh-uh, we're not buying it from resellers, period. Period. I hope you enjoyed the review. Thank you all so much for watching. Please let me know what you think of the brand and if you secured a tail far bag, let me know what colors you're looking for or that you did secure in the comments down below. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye.